This is the bargain box. Whenever I find anything at the flea market, garage sales, or the thrift store, I will show it to you when the box gets full. And then I will show you what I got. The bargain box. Hello there, welcome to this special edition of the bargain box con featuring, well, you probably couldn't see it, but my shoe is right there. Okay. So, let's start off. Box is kind of empty, but just trust me. My mom found, my mom and my niece found me a couple videos of, uh, Winnie the Pooh and the Honey Tree. Elmo size. And this. Wobulous World of Dr. Seuss. The only bad part about this is this. Watch. Can okay, you see the tape? Okay, watch. Okay, watch the tape. Okay. You see? See the tape. Okay, ready? The tape is exposed. You can see that. That's that part of the tape. That fell off. Oh well, it's okay. Everything was half price today anyway. At that estate sale. Now this estate sale that I'm talking about was the same one that I got Pong at. As you know, in the last episode I was hinting at something that was at that estate sale that I wanted if it was still there. And guess what? It was still there when we went there today. So I bring that box over here, because it will not fit in this box. It just won't. This will be thick. Ugh. Get a good focus on that. Do you see all that in there? You'll never guess. Okay, maybe you will guess what it is. Let me get closer. What you're looking at is an Atari 2600 with lots of stuff. Let me get on the floor, and I will show you exactly what is in that box. Move it out of the way, and... Okay, that'll be good. There's this controller, which doesn't go to the Atari, actually. I think this goes to the computer because it has this kind of plug-in right here. See that? It's got two buttons. We got whatever the heck these things do. If... I'm gonna send this to some of the video game reviewers on here, like... Uh, Angry Video Game Nerd. If one of you could tell me what this is and where it goes to, that'd be cool. Well, a couple other things. Okay, so those are that. I got two... Commodore controllers. See those. Two Commodore controllers. I'm guessing for the Commodore 64 or the like. I don't know. Okay, we got one, oops, two, three, wrong word, four standard controllers, four, and I've not tried any of this out yet, so, but I'll explain the price in a minute, the price you're not going to believe, okay, uh, next up, we got... Two keypad controllers. You can play keypad controller games. You have this, which I don't really know what it does, but I'm sure it's important. You got one, two, Two driving paddle controllers. Um, you got a pad paddle controllers, and this is actually one controller, but it has two things. It's a Y connector, so I guess this can play like pong and tennis and stuff. This really doesn't have anything to do with Atari at all or video games. This was just in the box. Mm. Didn't know it until I got home and looked through it. 
It's a dog collar. Here's another puppet prop, maybe for dumb dog. Anyway, we got one. Where is it? We got two AC adapters. I think one of these might go with the Pong too, so that might be good. Since Pong was made by Atari, also that one. And now we get to the good stuff, kind of. I'm gonna show you the system itself here. I'm gonna get to it. There's the big boy himself. The Atari 2600. And is that part of it? It's the four switch and it's the black box or the Vader, I guess it's called sometimes the Darth Vader model. Um a whole bag of instruction manuals and catalogs and the like. Now we get to the good stuff. The games. It came with, let's see, 18 games. Okay, actually, 17 games, because two are repeats. Two, two Pac-Man games. A Crash of 83. So yeah, those are interesting. Crash of 83. Uh, Pitfall. Heck yeah. Donkey Kong by Coleco. When I first saw this box and I went to go get the Pong, I thought this was a Coleco game. Which, I guess it's, well, it is a Coleco game, but I thought it was for, like, the Coleco vision. But it's not. We got... Breakout. Mega Mania. A Space Nightmare. Oh, jeez, what is this? Journey Escape. Oh, shoot. It's okay. Journey Escape. Video Chess, which doesn't sound very good. Just have to find out later. Basketball. Missile Command. I think I already got this game, though. So, yeah, we'll let's see. Asteroids. Uh, let's see. One more. Yars Revenge. It's a good game. I've played that before. Uh, Combat. It's got... Looks like lots of stuff, actually. That's a good deal. Um, Blackjack. Heck yeah. Three players. Ooh, that might be hard to pull off. Fortunately, I don't think I know three people that would want to play Atari. Code Breaker. Um, Space Invaders. Warlords. And Auto Racing, which also doesn't sound so good. Just think. Atari with games. It's got the controllers. All different sorts of controllers. And do you want to know how much all of this cost? It cost forty dollars. Four zero dollars. Is that like the best finder what? That's really all I gotta say about this for now. I'm gonna organize my stuff now. And I'll let you go so you can do stuff with your friends or whatever. So, catch you later. Bye. Happy bargain hunting. <laughs>